<sighs> that was a good night's sleep. Okay, let's get let's get some work done. Oops, wrong room. Okay, so let's work on improving this. Um, let's see. So maybe I think. Oh yeah, I have an idea. Um, let's see. So do I have any impulse item ducts? I'll just put up the recipe just in case. Let's see. Item duct. Yes, I have a lot. Uh, do I have a resonant retriever? Let's see. Retriever. Um, let's see. Wow. That needs a lot of stuff. Endurium nuggets harden. Okay, fuse quartz. I can use fuse quartz. Alright. Just one, please. Okay. Infusion. Okay. Let's see. So we got a fuse quartz. Okay. Endurium. Let's see. Let's just make some. Um. Let's make four, because that's what the default is. Alright. No pro- uh, no problem. So just gotta wait. Um, while I'm waiting. Let's see, maybe I should put some more- let's put some more sulfur in. Um, how much can I make? Um, how much can I make with all this sulfur ore? Let's see, so this gives me six. How much does this give me? 24. I should pulverize the nether. I should pulver pulverize the nether sulfur ore. Okay, um, maybe, maybe I can, I can, like, I can, like, get some, uh, do I have any? I only have four dark steel. Hmm. Um, let's see. Uh, flint. Flint? Nope. Uh. Eh, it's fine. Oh wait, no. I have I have gravel. I can. I have gravel. I can get flint. All right. I just wanted to put some flint in the uh, in the sag mill because because uh, sometimes uh, sometimes using flint will give me extra. Not sure how much I need, but let's grab this much. Not sure if this is going to be enough to process all this. Okay. Um, I'll just get the rest once it comes in. There we go. Okay. Perfect. Now, back up here. Endurium's done, right? Yep. Alright, Resonant Retriever. Uh, one of those needs to be converted to nuggets. Okay. Then I just need an Eye of Ender. Perfect. And I get two of them. Alright, so... What are the filters on these? Let's see, so this is Blacklist for... Um, ferrous Metal and Tin Dust, ignoring metadata. Alright. Paris, tin. Just wanted, I just want to get those two. I, I just want to get those two uh, like pulverized, so I can, so I can get, uh, that we can get my, um, I can get my filter set again. Okay, here we go. Um, and this one had, this one had an empty white list. Hmm. Hmm. You know, I, I'll deal with this some other time. Hmm. And, you know, this thing can output out the back. It doesn't need to... Hmm. This thing, this thing doesn't need to output out the top. It, it can output out the back. Uh... Which one's the back? Oh, right, right, right. The back is the interface. I can't do both input and output on the on the back. Right. So I guess I have to do the top. 
Um, let's see. So, yeah, I still wanted to do this. Biofuel. I still wanted, I still wanted to do that. Um, maybe, maybe, maybe better if I, maybe better if I did servos. I mean, I mean, retriever, a retriever works, but I mean, it blacklists, it blacklists um, these two. Mm. Hmm. You know, one more thing. Can we just convert? Can we just like convert this to a full size interface and have it uh, just have it do that? Let's make sure I can still access my recipes. Let's see. So, Sturdy's Quartz. Okay, I could still access it. Good. I mean, that saves cable. Plus, you can plus you can interact with more sides of the interface. So. Okay. Hmm. Let's think here. What am I gonna do? Mm, let, okay, so Crusher turns the. It makes the dirty dust, so. Okay, well, I I guess I'm lucky that I had some of that. Um, oops. Uh, wait, hold on. It was. Hold on. Does this have the same. Does this have the same metadata as the. I think I didn't do the tin. I don't think I did the tin right. Tin? Ah, oh, crap. Now it's a now it's a new now it's a new type of tin. Okay, can we just like set auto eject off and? Uh... All right. Oh. Hmm. All right, that's better. Um, auto eject on. All right, so yeah, here's my idea. Um, so we take these out, and put some impulse item ducts. Oops, not one there. Do the and do this. Then we get a retriever, which is not set to anything right now. Let's see. So let's ignore. Um, so, yeah, pulverized... F okay, wait. So the shiny metal... Oops. Shiny. Oh, this is gonna be clogged for a second. Okay. Uh, shiny metal. Pulverized shiny metal, 4872. Okay, 4872. Yes, um, so all the pulverized metal from the Thermal Foundation is associated with 4872. It's just different metadata. So if we, if we ignore metadata and we have the pulverized ferrous metal as a blacklist, then 6049, that's all of these dusts. And blacklist this. And then 6069 is the dirty dust. So, blacklist this. Hey, wait, hold on. Isn't there dirty platinum dust? Oh, yeah, there's that. When it pulverizes, uh, when it when it processes shiny, when it processes shiny ore. Um, when it processes shiny ore, that's gonna be that's gonna be an issue. I guess I'll, f I'll fix it once it, I'll fix it once it gets there. So disable that. Uh, why isn't this getting pulled out? Uh, wait, four eight seven two. Oh, it blacklists everything from Thermal Foundation. 
There should be some uh, dirty something in here. Yeah, I blacklist everything from Thermal Foundation. So I guess I can't. I guess I can't do that. Um, crap. I don't think I can. I don't think I can use the retriever. So that means that means I that means I use my. Uh, can we can we just get resonant servos? I think I think that might I think it might be better. Oops. Uh, okay, so fuse quartz again. And got it. All right. Maybe I should set this so that way it's a. Uh, okay, so let's set this as a blacklist ignore for this and this. Alright, and then this one as just a. Um. What was on here? Hmm. Alright, why don't we check? Great. It's not connected to anything, so I can't... Okay. That's better. Alright, I just want to check this one. This one was blank. This one was the... Okay, so... So the furnace did not have any filters on it, so... Ignored. Okay, that's better. Okay. So... Not exactly how I wanted it to go, but I mean it's fast. It's faster, so. All right, I'm gonna need another servo. Uh, more iron nuggets. More endurium. Let's see. Here we go. And then. Some fuse quartz. All right, so won't be able to craft the won't be able to craft fuse quartz until uh, until the endurium is done, which won't be for a while, considering how much power it takes. Hmm. Let's see, how many ender pearls do I have anyway? Sixteen. Jeez, that's not that's not a lot. How's my farm doing? Is it on? Oh, I forgot. To, I forgot to turn it back on after I did some maintenance. Good thing I checked. All right. So what I did was, um, where was it? Here we go. I have block containers for everything except the except the woods. So uh, these are and these are like much less expensive than uh, than 64k drives configured to one thing. And yeah, that's pretty much pretty much what I did. Um, I mean now the okay. Well, maybe I should I should uh, clear these out. There we go. Oh wait. Uh, Dust. Um. Yep, that'll do. I just need. Let's see, I just need to. I need to enrich this, and then smelt this, and we're all good. We should be getting. We should be getting more ender pearls now. Okay, enderium. Okay, a few squirts. Enderium. Perfect. Alright, and we didn't have any more. Yep. Okay, so... I can just, um... I can just do that for later. Okay, so... Guys, what did you what did you tell me before? Like, there was a, there was a new system for, uh, for, uh, for, like, um, uh, top, for dimension hopping? Really? Hmm. RF tools. 
Whoa. Okay, that's a that's a lot of stuff. But um what unknown dimlin? Dungeon loot? Huh. Okay. But more specifically, what do you want me to look at? Matter receiver. Hmm. I have everything I need except for the RF tools machine frame. Maybe I should maybe I should add that to my auto crafting. Oops. Um I can do that in here. Let's see. Here we go. And let's see. Nuclear assembler. Perfect. Um I had the recipe set up here. Alright. So I need a machine frame. Cool. I got a matter receiver. You also want me to look at the charge porter. Right. I need a redstone block. Alright. Cool. Oh, it's charging. Right. Uh, from my... Uh, uh, wait, can I make... Right, I can't make tesseracts yet. Wanted to put the... Wanted to put the, uh, wanted to put the, no, wanted to put the matter receiver, like, right here. And it's right on top of, uh, it's right on top of, uh, it's right on top of my, uh, it's right on top of my molecular assembler setup. Of course. How did I make this? Wait, there's a tesseract around here somewhere, I know it. Where is the tesseract? Hang on, back to my maintenance. Back to the maintenance area. Um, there was a tesseract. Okay, found it. All right, so that should that should allow the matter receiver to receive power. Yep, nope. perfect. All right, so I can use this. Hmm. All right. There's no name. Let's let's put a name on it. Home. Home. There. And charge porter target is set to one. Perfect. So I can I could teleport there. I could teleport there from any dimension, apparently. Using the charge porter. Cool. Um So then you wanted me to look at the matter transmitter for searching for going across dimensions, huh? This this will definitely be better than the book. Uh, this will definitely be better than the books because I don't have to be I don't have to be like in the same spot. I don't have to be in the exact spot to get back. So uh, let's get the matter transmitter, which needs a machine frame. Here we go. All right, so this will this will allow me to dimension hop, but I also needed a dialing device. Need more redstone. Let's see, two redstone torches. And that'll give me that'll give me the excess redstone as well. Okay, here we go, and then a machine frame. Um, let's just let's just be proactive about this and request three of them. Okay, dialing device. This will allow me to dial to a different dimension, but I might want another matter receiver. Might, might want another matter receiver, like uh, for the uh, for the dimension I want to talk to, for uh, for like in this case the Nether. So, I mean, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need to get. I'm gonna need to get a. Let's see, tesseract. Need it. I need tesseracts. I need auto crafting for tesseracts. It shouldn't be that hard. I mean, I mean, I can I could implement the logic for crafting the empty frame. <coughs> Let's see. So empty frame. Okay. Let's see. Tesseract frame empty. Good. It's using fuse quartz. All right. Um. Let me put this in here. 
But I need, I need fluid, uh, I need, uh, I need, uh, I need, like, I need fluid, uh, I need fluid transposers. Can't exactly do too much, I can't exactly do too much without, uh, without putting, put, without putting, like, a bunch of stuff under here for autocrafting. Alright, um, so what's, so what's up here? I'm gonna guess it's not... Terrible. It's not terrible. I mean, I mean, I just have to put a chest here, and then, and then some, uh, then some, an interface like. Just need to put some. Yeah, I just need to put an interface here, chest here. It's not bad. It's not great either, because I mean, I'd have to filter the input. I mean, if I had it, if I had something like, um, let me think, maybe like, um, let's see, fluid transposer. What's the? Um, shouldn't be bad. Oops. Uh, okay, let's do that here. Let's see. So I need. Uh, machine frame, reception coils, and copper gears. Copper gears. So let's do six of them. Here we go. Uh, reception coil. Three. Um. Yeah, and then. Then a then three resonant machine frames. Missing ender pearls, of course. How's my... How's this going, anyway? Wish I could bone meal these. I wish I could bone meal these ender lily seeds, but of course, of course I can't. It makes sense. Okay. Yeah, I might not be able to make all the resonant machine frames net right now. I should just, I should just manually crap. Oh crap! I have to wait. I have to wait. I mean, this this thing doesn't char this thing doesn't charge automatically. Uh, this thing doesn't charge automatically in my inventory. I have to plug it into some sort of power. I wish there was, I wish there was like an empty tesseract. I wish there was an extra tesseract somewhere that I wasn't using. Of course I, of course I'm always using some. I'm always using these, but yeah, I'm always using most of these. But sometimes, uh, sometimes I'm not. Like I mean, this car. I mean, this carpenter doesn't take power all the time. Um, speaking of which, do I have a resin? Do I have? Okay, I do have a resonant flex deck. Maybe I can. I can like extend this a bit. Actually, it's fine. It's fine. Let's just put these back. All right then. So basically, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be able to uh, put power into this matter receiver yet. That's just great. And wait, how thick is the ceiling? It's probably only one layer. It's one layer. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Have the yeah, sure, have the have the matter transmitter like have the matter transmitter like sticking out. I guess I have to leave it like that. Okay, um where's my watering can? Didn't I have one? Yeah, I did. Um let's see if uh, let's see if I can water uh, let's see if I can water the ender lilies. Let's see, so I needed Enderium, but I also needed Resonant Ender. I mean, that's seven Ender Pearls right there. Mm. Oh, wait. Um, just craft two, because I already have two Enderium base. Okay, we should be okay, so... Um, I mean, it's crafting Enderium right now. 
and craft this. Nope. It's still not done crafting this, which means I need to wait until it's done crafting before I can before I can submit a request for the and done. Okay. Test rack frame. Here we go. Alright. Alright, come on, come to this direct frame. Okay. Now I just need to fill this up with some resonant ender. Perfect. And it's in the system, so let's make a full blown tesseract. And I need bronze. Bronze, three, go. Alright. So we got another Tesseract for the for the nether. Let's go. Um here we go. You should rename the you should rename this uh let's rename this to uh Dimension Hop. Alright, and let's put it let's put uh, let's put that as the icon now. Let's take a look. Ooh, looks good. Alright. So first stop, nether. All right, I should put this away because I don't need it. Get the book back, get this back. And let's put the matter receiver underneath this Tesseract, which will be set to energy. Disabled and receiving energy only. All right, so matter trans, oh, oops, not matter transmitter, matter receiver. All right, nether. Uh, what's going on? Oh, it's a wisp on fire. Hmm. Wondering if I should, like, capture a wisp. Hmm. Okay, well, this has power, so let's head back home. Starting teleportation. The world moved. What? What is this? Teleport to a new location. Okay. So, yeah, that's new. Okay, let's just head back up here. Let's get this book. And let's put... Oh, this needs power as well. I need another Tesseract. Man. All right. Uh, yeah, let's see. Wasn't there like a... Wasn't there like a Tesseract or something back here? Yep, there it was. But it sends energy. Hmm. I'll just... Um, can we just... Man, I wish I could make another Tesseract. And I don't have enough ender pearls. I only have two. Man. I could go Enderman hunting, but... I could go Enderman hunting for... Uh, I could go Enderman hunting for more ender pearls, but... I think... I think that's gonna have to wait. You know what, I could have put the dialing device back up here. Wait, does this need power? Yes, it does need power. Alright. So, maybe I can do, like, the dialing device here. I have a ha uh, I have an axe. Use it. Let's see. Um, teleport. Alright, so yeah, these do both need power. I'm gonna need to... Gonna need to get some more ender pearls, but... I think that'll have to wait for another day. Let's take a nap. 